Let's start with Hillary Clinton, a big speech in Texas yesterday, talking about her plan to expand voting rights. The details in a second, but what was interesting about this is a lot of times politicians will say the other side, or the Democrats will say the Republicans. Hillary Clinton decided she wanted to name names. Governor Perry is hardly alone in his crusade against voting rights. In Wisconsin, Governor Scott Walker cut back early voting. In New Jersey, Governor Chris Christie vetoed legislation to extend early voting. And in Florida, when Jeb Bush was governor, state authorities conducted a deeply flawed purge of voters before the presidential election in 2000. Coincidence, of course, that those four Republicans just happened to be candidates or potential candidates for the Republican presidential nomination in 2016. Here's what Hillary Clinton said should happen. She said we should have automatic voter registration. When you're 18 years old, you should be automatically registered unless you opt out. She also wants it to be easier to register online. And she also says early voting should be expanded, and a number of states are trying to draw, draw that back last time. Uh, I'll just say for the record, pretty common sense. I get there are some issues about, you know, verifying identification and all that. I think you can do both. Uh, but let's get to the politics for Hillary Clinton here. She's pushing this policy, but politically, what is she trying to do? She's trying to consolidate the Obama coalition, who obviously did not vote for her. And she wants to get them out. She wants to get them excited. And this is a way to do that. So I think this is aimed straight at them. And a, a, is it strange or just a sign of her confidence that she's going directly after the Republicans by name? Yeah, um, I was honestly surprised that she was as overt as she was in going after Scott Walker, Rick Perry, some really second, well, Scott Walker is, is certainly isn't a second tier candidate, but some of these folks who, who might not be at, at the top of the list, I talked to the Scott Walker people, they were, they seemed somewhat giddy that, that she would legitimi legitimize his campaign as she did. So, um, you know, clearly she's trying to, you know, change the, the trend of her negative numbers, but she might, may have indirectly helped Scott Walker in the short term. We'll see how this one plays yeah. out.